Hey guys, this is Tom from Tom Tutorials here today and guess what? I'm doing a little quick video on basically how to install Dark RP on a Gary's Mod server. I know a lot of people always have this question. They don't know how to install game mode, they have some issues. So I just wanted to, you know, clarify this stuff for you guys. And by the way, guys, I just wanted to thank you for all the 400 subscribers right now you guys are awesome thanks for thanks for supporting me all this way I really love you guys you guys are awesome so here we go let's jump right into this video so the first thing that we're gonna wanna do right now is we're going to have to you're gonna to have to click the first link in the description let me just close out of my amazing logo picture so now you're gonna to go to um so it's gonna bring you to the github page the fptje dark rp page and you're simply gonna look over here where my cursor is and you're gonna look down you're gonna right below the clone and desktop button you're gonna click download zip and and you're simply gonna save this file and i'm using firefox right now that's why this little windows showing up but i mean if you're using chrome then um just do whatever you do with chrome just open it up in windows explorer with chrome so i'm going to save the file real quick and then it should be done downloading so now you're just going to double click it if you're in windows explorer so just open up the zip file basically and if like right now as i did so here we go and now i'm just going to close out of this window because i don't think we'll really need it and I'll just put this on a different window right here okay so now you guys can see I have this window and this window and this window basically like see it says Gmod server I have a test Gmod server up right now well it's it's not supposed to be up actually in fact so what you guys are gonna want to do first is you see where like the start.bat you guys should have that file if you guys follow the tutorials properly to um, make a Gary's Mod dedicated server so now you're just going to edit it with Notepad++, Sublime, Text, 3, 2, whatever, or just click Edit, which will give you Notepad. And then just go down to where you can see um, this line, start, wait, slash, forward slash, wait, srcds.exe, negative console, negative Gary's mod. So right here, you guys see I already have this typed in, but I will have this this little this little segment for you guys in the description and it's not supposed to be space roleplay as you guys may have noticed it's supposed to be in fact dark rp in lowercase and do not put um uppercase d space i mean no space lowercase arc and then uppercase rp and then lowercase dash master because that will not work and just trust me on this guy so you're basically one of the description you're just gonna copy this line and you're gonna make sure you have this space right here as I have highlighted in blue and then this space right here unless you don't have anything else on this line which I think you guys might have because of the map and the number of max players but anyways just make sure you have a space if you have any anything on this side on this side and um and anything on this side so here we go so after we're done that so we have a game mode dark rp we're just gonna go file save we're gonna hit like either control s save i don't want to save this though because this is for something else so you guys have saved that i hope so at least so now now what you're gonna want to do in in your root folder as it's called bin c strike gary's mod platform source engine steam apps SRCDS, start dot bat steam app id don't worry about the start.bat back. That's just the backup file that I made for myself. So now you're going to go to Gary's mod in lowercase. So now you see we have this. We're going to go to game modes. And then I already did that. But for you guys, you're going to drag. You see, like, remember this folder? Um, this zip file that we downloaded. Uh, we're sim and it's not going to be called, like, uh, the two in the um, brackets unless you guys have more than one which windows automatically just adds a one two three whatever so now we're just gonna simply drag dark rp master onto there but since i already had it on there it's already there and let, let um let's just pretend this was already called dark rp dash master so as you guys so 
I just dragged that. Let's just imagine I took this and dragged it. That's what you guys are supposed to do. Drag the Dark RP Dash Master into the Game Modes folder. So after you guys have done that, let's just close out of that. So now we have this window, right? So now we're in G like whatever your server is, Gary's Mod slash Game Modes. So now we have Base, you have Terror Town, whatever. Now rename Dark RP Dash Master to Dark RP. Simply that. And then you should be all set as you can see in here we have all that stuff and basically it's renamed the same as this dot text file which comes with dark rp and any other game mode probably which is just renamed to a different kind of game mode so right now we can just go back and we can run our start dot bat but i in case don't i in this case don't need to because i already know it's going to work but you guys may want to test this out just to make let the game mode set itself up and that kind of stuff and if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And once again, guys, thank you so much for supporting me with that with those 400 subscribers. You guys are amazing. And that's it for this video, guys. Peace out. Yeah. So I'll just give you guys a brief demo. You will be extinct.